So here we have a Volvo and an iCar so iCar soft diagnostic scanner. The scanner is able to get into all the control modules on Volvo vehicles. Not only the check engine light or the ECU, but also ABS transmission, um, ECM, and a lot of um, different control models. We're going to look at that in a minute. Here, but what the first thing you will do is you'll plug this underneath the dashboard. You have the OBD2 port right down there. Once you plug that in, you'll see the scanner turns on. But you want to make sure that you turn the ignition to position two, so all your dash lights are on. And once you do that, then you can come here, press enter, just like Volvo, press enter again, and then we'll do an automatic search so we can detect what make and model it is. And then we'll also do a smart scan. What this will do is we'll go through the different modules that are in this vehicle and we'll scan them for codes. And uh, then once it does that, we'll take a look at uh, different modules in a second. And this scanner will allow you to read and clear codes. So let's take a look here in a second. And it is done. So the first thing that we're going to look at is the transmission control module. So if you have any issues with the transmission, there is most likely will be a code here. And remember, a generic OBD2 scanner will not be able to tell you these codes. But here, you can set gear 3 incorrect ratio to codes. And then gear 4 incorrect ratio. So if you come back, you can go down and erase these codes. But you should only do this once you fix the problem. Otherwise, those codes will come right back on. But uh, then you press OK. And that's it for clearing them. You can also look at some live data here. You can press F1, select all of them, and then F2. And then you can see different things here. You can see the, the position. And let's go to the ABS module, press enter. And you can read the codes here. Pedal position sensor faulty. You can see one code there, and you can go ahead and clear that code once you fix the problem. SRS or the airbag, if your airbag light is on, you can come down here, go read codes, driver airbag, stage one, resistance to high. So it's the airbag here. That's usually a back clock spring, but let's go back. And then you can erase the code, but you'll have to fix the problem first. And the CEM module, yes. Common issues with this module. You can see here, the, there is one code for that. And then driver information module. You can see climate control, steering wheel module. So you can see all the different modules that you can go and diagnose. So basically you'll be able to read and clear codes from these modules.